Hello and welcome to Voltaire's Nightmare. Uh, we've got a new series going on now. The plan. We are starting as Stendhal, which is this uh, free province, poor province even, nation here in uh, northern Germany. The plan is to first form Prussia and then form Germany and, you know, you know, historic German Empire borders. That's the plan at least. So, um, originally I had planned on starting as Saxony. Um, Saxony cannot form Prussia with its culture that it starts with, which is probably Upper Saxon or Lower Saxon or something. East Falian, maybe. Um, so the plan used to be attack for Stendhal, which is Markish. Markish can form Prussia. And, uh, yeah, do it that way. Um, but, I don't know, um, Saxony is pretty big and it turned out to be a little bit of a walkover for much of the game, so, yeah, Stendhal. It's gonna be a little bit more difficult, I like that. But yeah, it's pretty good. Anyway, um, Voltaire's Nightmare. What the fuck? It's, uh, it's both huge and tiny at the same time, so the borders get a little bit of Anatolia, um, you don't even get Gibraltar, or I mean, I guess you do. That's Gibraltar down there, but you don't get like the very tip. You also don't get the very tip of Scotland or pretty much any of Sweden. No Finland at all, so uh, that's sad for Finns. Um, but what you do get is a shit ton of provinces in the HRE. Like, look at this. Um, what's the name of the province? Uh, if I go and search for Wurttemberg, just check out this state. Where is it? Here, Württemberg State. Look how fucking big this thing is. There are 36 provinces in this state. It's crazy. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> the states that we have, two... I mean, I guess this one's pretty big, but yeah, our capital state is only two. It's sad, whatever. Um, so, another thing I had originally planned on doing was using a development reworked mod. Which means, uh, instead of having, you know, the standard, what are they even called again? Base tax and, and base production and base manpower. It changed it to population and production and organization, I think. Um, but it just didn't really work out all that well. So we're only using the Voltaire's Nightmare mod. Right, I think that's all I really need to talk about. Let's just get into the game. First things first, what do we want as our mission? Solidify Papal Relations is always decent. We've got the same buttons as we usually do, so that might be a thing that we do. Uh, move, remove Havelberg. Also a good idea, especially considering these guys are Slavic religion. So we wouldn't get so much aggressive expansion with the, uh, the neighbors. Let's just open these up a second. Um, I guess we could also do some rivals. So Arnholt is where? Find Arnholt. Arnholt is... Oh, right, that big one. Right, okay. You've rivaled me. Brunswick has rivaled me. And Lusitea. Which is this guy. Okay, so they're pretty close. They're pretty big. Um, will Saxony ally me? No. They will royal marry me, though. I'm going to try and get Saxony on my sweet side. Because they're fucking huge. Um, Meissen, you will ally me. Beautiful. Uh, Bohemia will not. Austria, Bavaria, no. Swabia, no. Right. Get our diplomats back. Royal marriage to Saxony. Is that making them a little bit more sweet to me? Yeah, we're just gonna have to improve relations with them for a bit. Uh, we get a diplomatic annexation, blah de blah, on hold, or we could get ease the tension and get instant sixty relations with a shit ton of people, which means we can ally with Saxony on the seventeenth, which will. We're definitely going to do as soon as we can. That's like the first thing we're going to do. Beautiful. 
Lovely. So that's some pretty powerful allies we have to start off with. Um, I think I'm pretty good with the, the rivals that they've picked out for me. Um, so what was it? Anhalt, Lusitea, and Brunswick. Uh, there's Brunswick. Anhalt. Do I want Lusitea? I, mean, I don't plan on going that direction just yet. Are any of these in it? Schwer Schwerin. Schwerin would be a great one. There, yeah, Schwerin. Unless I can get Linoni. No. Lindau? Definitely a good one. Right, yeah, let's go for Lindau. And then we have... Just rival of rival. Fuck. Alright, so we lost the good, the good uh, mission. Which is a shame. Uh, but rival of rival is still fine. So, mines, where are you? You're down here somewhere. There you are. Let's improve relations with you. Do we want to talk to the estates? Um, hmm, not really just yet. I think we're fine for now. We've got Lizizi asking for an alliance, but they're Slavic. No. Quaid, 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 what the fuck? Quedlinburg. Don't know who the fuck you are. Apparently you're one of these provinces? Is that you? There they are. They're tiny, fuck that. And Hildesheim, which is... Oh, that yellow guy. Yellow guy's pretty big. I mean, as big as five provinces will ever be, but Hildesheim is... Yeah, they've got potential. I'll accept that one. Right, we also have a couple of free merchants. So, Hanover, collect from the trade. And Erfurt, transfer the trade. We're in the Hanover node. If we can conquer our way up to the Lubeck node, that's an end node. Hamburg is not an end node. Um, Antwerp is another end node feels sad to me that London goes into the continent instead of the other way around. Very sad. Anyway, whatever. Magdeburg now wants an alliance. And you up here somewhere. Magdeburg. There they are. No, I don't want an alliance with you unless you will accept vassalization. In which case we will definitely do it. But you will not, so no. Make an A tiny tiny amount of money so that sucks um our guy is pretty decent uh let's hope he gets a good heir and we are a margravit hereditary mon monarchy that's pretty good i'm okay with that our provinces have got you know decent development nothing too super special um but yeah i think we're good after we get a shit ton of people asking us for alliances, of course. Alright, so Zemzizi. Don't know who the fuck you are. Looks like you're Slavic, so we're going to decline. We'll not be accepting alliances from Slavs. That sounded incredibly racist, and I apologize, but it really wasn't meant to be. You don't have any allies, so we'll start building a spy network on you. Meanwhile, Mycin, who is our ally. We will accept that. 420 consorts, not bad. We can deal with that. One ducat in profits so far. Hopefully that gets better. And everyone's doing a bunch of shit. Uh, we have fulfilled none of the Age of Empire things. You'll see a lot of people start out um, they basically take their Golden Age straight away. Because it doesn't matter how many of these you take, as long as you have these three of these filled, you can start your Golden Age. Um, and a lot of people will have the things like 10 infantry units, uh, notoriety, competent ruler, possibly imperial ties, etc, etc. So we'll, we'll see a lot of people do uh, their Golden Age very, very quickly. Right, uh, what else do we need to look at? I think we're pretty much sorted. Reform into Prussia, we need... Definitely to change religion, but that's obviously not yet. 
We need Twangsty, Lidsbark, and Gdinsky. That's obviously Gdansk. Gdinsky, where are you? Can it be one of these provinces? Hang on, let me just open that up again. I just spell it. Gdinsky. Alright, I'm, I'm looking at the wrong. God damn it. Right, so we need to get over here. We need Twangsty. And what was the other one? Uh, Lisbach. Lisbach here. We need these three provinces. Which uh, is not too difficult. I think we'll be uh, pretty solid in getting over there. Uh, a lot of this. Well, um, basically all of it isn't the wrong culture, so, sorry, the wrong religion. So we are definitely going to have to take religious ideas at some point. Ideas in this mod are very different. Um, yeah, we have early manufacturing, early cultural, and early logistic. Crusades, however, seem very tasty, especially considering the mountain of wrong religion shit that we border. We also get cavalry flanking ability, uh, movement speed is going to be glorious. Cav cost, meh. Uh, army tradition, meh. Uh, don't care about that, but land leader maneuver, uh, looting speed's alright. But basically, crusades. Fuck yes. Um, manufacturing ideas look really tasty too, though. Ooh. But you need to be, I think, level 4 to take these? God damn it. Um, where's the easiest way to check that? Yeah, unlocked at level four. We're currently level zero, so it's gonna be a while. Um, I am gonna let this first episode go for thirty minutes instead of the usual twenty, just because it's you know it's the first episode, and uh, it sounds like a pretty decent idea to me. Oh, we lost a dude. Why did we lose this? But we rivaled Lazizi. Havelberg there, actually. Because if we can rival Havelberg, that'd be great. Uh, they are not. Alright, Lizizi. It was a Lizizi choice to rival you. That was a horrible pun, I apologize. That was terrible. 106. Actually, why am I paying for my military? Get that down, get that down. 161. Quite a small income. Uh, but it shouldn't be too bad. Might be able to afford... Hmm, shall I get another cavalry? Ooh, that's pretty dodgy, actually. I'd rather just get two more infantry. Yeah, go up to a force limit, two more infantry. Sounds glorious. We're gonna be done on the 17th of October, so 1st of October, let's raise the maintenance to half. You don't need to pay for them. Oh really? You're still locked at half morale? Fuck it then. The whole point of doing that is so that you can move them immediately, but you don't need to pay for their maintenance. Alright, there we go. We have our claim. Let's just check this on full maintenance now, because we're going to go to war with Havelberg, who allied with Unhalt, you bastards. Alright, military, armies, rivals, Anhalt has... 3,000, so they're not huge. And we outnumber them together. Well, I'm, we equal them together. We could stack wipe these bastards real quick. Because they can't run away unless they get military access. Which they might do. Alright, this easy no longer a valid rival. So let's go with... Hmm. Who have we got here? Just so many. There's so fucking many. I'd like to rival another one of these Slavic dudes. Ruppin? Is Ruppin here? No. How about Brandenburg? Brandenburg is there. Good. There we go. There's a rival. Let. Does fix the music. I have disabled the uh, Breedsman's Epistles, yet it still tries to play it, which is 
pain in the ass. I need to turn this off, play Constantinople, and uh, so it won't shuffle and it won't do any context sensitive stuff. Eh, which is a bit of a pain, but whatever. Right, nobility. Let's call a diet. We... Actually, we're not going to be able to get you to 40 influence, are we? Hmm. Oh, hum hum hum. It's either that or give away some of my land to the nobility. That would raise it to... Where, where is the influence? Influence by 30%, fuck me. That's a lot of influence to give them. No, I can't afford that. Let's just uh, pay for a leader normally. And we're gonna go with... Gregor. Sounds like a lovely leader. 212, could be better, could be worse. So, not too unhappy with it. Um, let's take you back. And let's declare war. So, hopefully we'll, uh, if we don't stack wipe him, hopefully we, uh, get him so he can't run too far away. Come on, come on. There we go. 7.5 war score. Lovely, we stack wiped him. Let us drop a single unit. The rest of the guys are going to go south, and we're going to see if we can't fight Mycin. Okay, you only need 2,000 men. Let's just attack Mycin. Oh, come on, win it, win it, win it, win it. You're flanking him. Fight harder. I think we're going to lose. We're definitely going to lose. Fuck. Fucky fuck. They're going to stack wipe him. Can I, can I run away, please? I don't want to be stuck away. It's just my calf here. Where am I running to now? Shit, that was uh, unexpected. They have a 3 one, one so I don't know where they got the, uh, the ability to fucking kick my ass like that. I guess we did attack them in the woods. Well, that's a great start. I swear I'm not shit at this game. All right, uh, let's bring you back. Let's uh, do that. And let's start fabricating or building a spy network on you. All right, we're almost back at 5,000 men. Let's wait one more month for some morale, and then we're going to go and attack this army. Bring it there on the 12th of October. Oh wait, no, they apparently just marched straight through my fort because of reasons. How in the fuck did they do that? Uh, we're gonna drop the weakest unit to stop them from recruiting more, and then we're gonna follow them, and we're gonna stack wipe them. Because fuck these guys. Come on. Oh, you're retreating there, are you? Well, you're fucking dead, so get fucked. Alright, so we're gonna drop a unit there. We're gonna go sit on your capital. And we're gonna go over here as well. You have been summarily beaten. GG. No fucking re. Lovely. Um, looks like we're gonna have to drop another unit here. The rest can walk over here and help with that siege. And yeah, the war is won. So now we'll just uh, speed through it and wait until victory is ours. Fucking hell. Slavic gives plus two attrition. That's painful. That's really painful. I 
could just peace out on halt entirely. I might do that because this is not part of any state that I am interested in. Hmm. Nah, fuck it. We'll keep it. We might take some land from them. Although, hmm, nah, no, no, we're not going to take land from Anhalt. We are just going to wait. Alright, I'm going to take the cab away. Put the infantry back in. And I'm going to take out the weak dude. Lovely. Get this sieged up. Right, and that's the first war victory. We we could have lost there if they'd have, after they had uh, beaten us in Stendhal, if they'd have come and attacked us in Hildesleben, we'd have been fucked. But instead, they're stupid, so we win. Oh, they've got another province down here. Meh, whatever. Got enough. So I want this. Actually, Anhalt, I'm gonna take your money. I'm gonna take a Humiliate. And I'm going to take some war reps. No, I'm not. Really. Is that so? Will you give me military access? Yes, you will. Oh, you got an extra 4,000 men. Of course you do. Sixth of November, fifth of November. But yes, go try and siege this province back. Because I own it. But you get the negative. They're fucked. It's a few more losses than I can really stomach at this point, but... Whatever. I'm gonna take the war reps. I'm gonna take exactly what I want. An heir to the throne. Meinhard. Gerhard. Siegmund. Jacob. Conrad. Conrad sounds awesome, so I'll take that. Right, there's 100%. And hold, you will now do what I ask. Money, humiliate, war reps, annul your treaty with Mycin. That is Mycin. Is there two Mycins? There must be. Where's the other Mycin? Anyway, I don't like you having that alliance. Or that alliance. Or that alliance. Get fucked. I get five prestige. Not bad, not bad. More importantly, power projection. And I will take this province. Thank you very much. Our realm grows. All right. Do we core it right now, or should we wait until the war exhaustion goes away? Going down 10 per month. Well, already it's gone down four, uh, it was 14 ducats, right? Or 14 admin points. Fuck it, 11's not bad. We'll just take it out. Right, uh, I believe Schwerin is doing shit with you, so we'll leave you alone. Lazizi, allied with a bunch of people. Lindau, allied with a bunch of people. Magdeburg, allied with a shit ton of people. Lots of allies. Friesland is your... No, that's not Friesland. Friesland's up here. There. Interesting. Friesland, what is your liberty desire? 18.5%. Could be better. Mm-hmm. Alright. Where do we attack? Brennenborg and Lindau. Brennenborg is Lindau here. Not sure how many men Lindau has. How about we wait till this is cored and we'll see what the uh, the state of things is then. Maybe we'll have a bit um, a bit more force limit. It's only a fucking really small amount of uh, product uh, development, but it gets us closer to our aim, which is over here. Plus, we need to liberate Brandenburg from the freaking evil people, the Slavs. Berlin especially. Alright, local noble power grows. Um, this sucks. A lot. 
Um, I think we're going to fight them. I'm gonna actually move out of the province. I'm going to let him rise up. And then I'm going to go back in. I'm going to get there on the 12th of August. But first, we're going to spend 10 military points so that we flank him on both sides. And our cavalry doesn't take any damage whatsoever. Lovely. We lost, what, 100 men? Less than 100 men. I like it. Currently making fucking no money at all, so let's lower the maintenance. You can recover your dudes with a tiny bit of maintenance. Let's lower inflation. And... There's a mission. Lovely. New mission. Manpower needs to recover. Vassalize Halberstad. Who the fuck is Halberstad? Halberstad. Here. You're only one province, but you're allied with fucking everybody. Look at this shit. Look at this. It's crazy. I mean, if I could bring my allies to battle with me, that would be great, but... Brunswick seems to be an easier target, for fuck's sake. Build a spy network here. And Zemzizi, which is... You. I think that's the mission we're going to go with. Um, right. Making 152. Let's lower the maintenance all the way. Root out a little bit of corruption. And we'll see. Land force limit is still at 6. Nice if I had a little bit more of that. I could do some drilling, but I'd really prefer the money right now. Money is more important for me. Now, what is our missionary strength? Minus 1.3%. I'm fairly sure we could overcome that 1.3%. Especially if we do, like, state edicts. Oh, fucking hell. Who is Breha? You sound Slavic. You're not Slavic. So where are you? Oh, that's you. Okay, you were very helpful to me, actually. So, unless Mycin wants to kill you... They don't. Ah, uh, there's the little mycin. Right. Mycin, what kind of desires do you have? You want to kill Anholt, you don't really care about Breha. Okay, so I'm going to accept this. They were quite useful in my war against Anholt. Maybe I should have fully annexed Anholt, that would have been a pretty good start to the map. Uh, start to the campaign. 7, 3, 7. Oh no, that's... It's only really Zerbst that would be valuable, but still. Maidborg, this would be a very valuable province. They've got a shit ton of allies. Alright, when can we take some tech? Tech is super expensive or something? No, 600 base. Okay. Them is normal then. Mm-hmm. So... Try and get a claim on Brunswick. Let's try and get a claim on Haberstad. Because if we go to war with Brunswick, we'll be at war with Haber... It's whatever that's called. And we'll take them both in the same war. Um, this would be in our state as well. This is a really big state. I want all of this. Lazizi, I would love to attack as well. But... Mm. Ooh, you've got a lot of... Unrest. 2.9 years, roughly, until they rise up. Um, overextension, non-accepted culture intolerance, separatism. Painful amounts of bullshit. These ideas, do any of them give missionary strength? Mm. Nope. No, they do not. I get missionary strength here, though, which is probably going to come in very handy. Also, it's five ideas per national idea, which I like. So, in uh, base E4, it's three, which is far too few. In Mayon Taxes, it is seven, which 
makes sense because you've got seven ideas in each group. Um, I like it. It's actually not seven anymore, is it? I'm talking about the old version of Mayo in Texas. Right now it's one. Um, but yeah, I, I like it. I like I like five is good. It's a good number. All right, let's get a claim on you. There's nothing else I can do with you, is there? So we'll revoke you. And uh, yeah, that is where we're going to leave this episode. So I hope you have enjoyed it. Um, brand new series. So things like um, likes and comments and sharing it and all that shit is really quite important i hate like you know begging for this kind of shit every time so i generally put um you know like share blah 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 at the end of every episode but this time it's like first episode it's really important so if you like you could just you know click the button what, what do the youtubers say what do the popular guys say and like, smash that like button hump it just click it a bunch of times an odd number of times anyway i'm ranting so i apologize for that Hope you enjoyed the episode, and I hope you stick around for the rest of the series. I think it's going to be a fun one. So, see you next time, guys. Bye-bye.